good morning welcome back to my channel welcome back to vader day two um it is friday so last day of the working week if you only work monday to friday obviously <laughs> uh but yeah how is everyone today um i'm good i'm just um rendering yesterday's um vlog and yeah so <sighs> it is 10 past 11 I'm up, showered, dressed, ready for the day, but I haven't washed my hair <laughs> because um, I'm going out tomorrow. Now I've got you just literally, I haven't got you on my tripod <laughs> um, because the camera nearly fell on the floor um, because what you are on is really slippery. It's one of the jewellery boxes and yeah, so we won't do that again uh, so you're a little bit low <laughs> and uh, but anyway um what was i saying let me spin you around a little bit that's it um what was i saying yes i'm going out tomorrow um tomorrow saturday obviously but i'm going out with my mum dad and sister to my aunt's house um she is has invited everyone round for Chinese, um, so that should be really nice. So I'm trying to leave my hair as long as I can <laughs> before I need to wash it. So I might wash it tonight, just over the bath or whatever, or I might do it tomorrow. We shall see. Anyway, yesterday I showed you the jumper. I'm going to show you once more, and because it's on, only because it's in daylight. <laughs> um, but this is the finished jumper, and is growing on me I suppose um but it looks really cute so yeah this is the finished jumper I'm not going to show you again I'm going to put it away and yeah so last night I had finished that keep going blurry um I had finished that and I was thinking to myself there's a few other things that I want to make but um it was about half past 11 I'm like oh I'm not gonna start anything Ian had already gone to bed and I thought, oh sorry, I'll just um, cast on something. So um, I did and it is this <laughs> adorable little dummy clip. Oh my goodness, it's so cute. Um, I was just going through Pinterest. Um, it is supposed to be like a Mickey Mouse type design. Um, it is curling so I will um, just pin it down and I probably will um, steam block it just so it will stay straight um, and I have left the towel to do the or to sew the clip on the reason I didn't put the clip on last night is because um, my box of odds and sods is under the bed and as I said Ian was in bed he was asleep and I didn't want to wake him up um, and I thought well putting a clip on is just going to take like two seconds um, but how adorable is that it's so cute and it was so easy um, no pattern um, all the ones that I found on Pinterest were to buy from Etsy and things but I'm not being funny three little squares uh, squares <laughs> three little circles three little circles two white circles and I cast on seven or well, I chained seven sorry and then so in total it's six single crochets along when I got to the end I just chained 20 and then carried on the row or I single crochet three chain 20 and then single crochet three again really really simple um and i tried my best to stitch this on without getting the red stitches at the front and i think i succeeded <laughs> um obviously with the white i wasn't really that bothered because that's on the back uh but i think it's adorable um there is a few more that i want to make and i don't know whether i'll show them now or not right now but um show them before the baby's here or whatever i don't know um but yeah, I, that took about an hour, I think. I was watching, um, oh, who was I watching? I was watching Sophie Payne. Um, her new vlogs come out. And I was watching Jan. Um, she got two new books. Um, she got a 
book about a little boy that's a crocheter. I can't remember what it's called. And then she got a crochet book um, that was uh, designs for little girls that were really, really cute. Um, so yeah, I was watching Jan and I watched Sophie Payne. But other than that, that's um, all I've done. But today I'm gonna do a few more bits on it, or not on this, but a few more bits for the baby. Um, so, so far I have got one, two, three, four, five, six items for him. Um, and Casey said that he doesn't need any sleep suits or anything like that, or anything not to three months, because she could dress him in a different outfit every day of the month. <laughs> so, um, yeah, I still might make him the little dungaree set, but I might make the size up. I don't know yet, I don't know, <laughs> because obviously that's summer isn't it, and he's going to be bought at the end of this month, mm, I might do, will we get an Indian summer this year, I hope so, um, an Indian summer is like, um, we get it in September and October, so it's like a really hot, uh, late heat wave type thing, um, you never know, you never know, um, but I don't want to make it and he never ever be able to wear it, so I might just wait till he's a bit older and make the bigger size, like I did for Mikey. Um, yeah, anyway, that's enough of me rambling on for now. I'm going to wait for this to edit, um, catch up with the few videos that have been put up. Oh, I also watched um, Kendra from... Hooked on Happenstance, Happenstance Place, I think that is her two channels, um, and she's been gone for a month or so, and she's now back, so I'm looking forward to um, watching her, and yes, so anyway, I'm going to go, because I'm really rambling, and I'll probably be a really rambly one today, because we're not doing anything, not that I know of, anyway, and uh, yeah. So before I forget, I thought I would quickly show you the pattern that I printed off yesterday. Um, <clears throat> the one that um, Randy has um, done. So this is the pattern. I don't know how well it's going to show. Um, but obviously I won't be doing it in yellow. <laughs> um, but it is a Karen um, pattern. I did leave the link, or I have left the link in um, the vlog that I'm putting up today. So yesterday's vlog and if I remember then I will put it in today's vlog as well but um, it's a free pattern and the sizes are quite big to be honest like a small is 40 inch a medium is 48 inch a large is 56 inches extra large is 64 2xl is a 72 so it does go up to quite big um, I would probably need to do the large or extra large um, depending on how much that's finished bust measurement is there a I suppose that's finished yeah so yeah anyway <laughs> that is the pattern um I still need to find out whether I've got enough yarn for it or not um but I thought it was really pretty and Randy has shown in her video a picture of her wearing it and it looked really nice so I just thought it's a nice sort of cover up in like more than a actual top you can just put it over a vest top or whatever um so yeah I just thought I'd quickly show you that so I'm just working on something else <laughs> um I'm working on something in green this time uh so yeah it probably it not probably it will be another dummy clip um but yeah I've just started it but I am just sat down and I'm really hungry it's two o'clock and um I thought I'd show you what I'm having for lunch um now I never thought I would like this sort of thing but oh my goodness I had one a couple of weeks ago and it is the John West lunch to go or on the go and it's a tuna um like snack pot thing or a lunch pot um it's italian style and it has got pasta tomatoes courgettes red peppers in a basil and extra virgin olive oil dressing oh my god it is so nice um if you like tuna and you like pasta you're gonna like this um i don't like tomatoes but the tomatoes are not that strong and they're sort of mixed in and it's really nice once i've opened it i'll show you the inside um and a cup of tea so 
that's my lunch. I'm just watching Mary's Crochet Chit Chat. Um, still catching up with YouTube. And uh, yeah. I've been on my phone for a little while. What was I doing? Ah, I was watching Englishman in Malta. Englishman. Englishman in Malta. He was live. Um, <clears throat> and... I was just watching his live and um, yeah so if you like Malta or you're interested in going to Malta um, as I know a few people have said in my comments that they're um, since I've been and vlogged there and you've seen pictures and so on and so on uh, it's something that you might like or somewhere that you might like to go um, his channel is Englishman in Malta he is a Englishman that has emigrated, I suppose, to Malta years ago, and he just goes round and shows you all the different sites. He shows you where the best places are. He goes exploring. Um, at the moment, there's a lot of um, like we call them festivals here, but there they call them feasts. Um, they have fireworks and. Um, loads of food and all different stuff so go check out his channel if you're interested in Malta uh, I just thought I would put that out there but um and if you do go and um check out his channel and you subscribe then maybe just leave a comment to say where you've come from because I have interacted with him quite a little quite a little bit quite a bit commented on his videos and just commented on his live and I have added him on Facebook and things like that just to see the different places and what's new and and everything like that <laughs> anyway i'm gonna go and open my lunch and i will show you what it looks like on the inside so this is what it looks like on the inside now you have to forgive the looking a little bit like cat food when you first open it but it does come with a fork obviously i'm at home so i'm going to be using a proper fork you just have to sort of mash it up a little bit and um it looks fine after that but it just tastes it tastes it smells a little bit like pizza you know when you first get a pizza like a stone baked pizza that's what it smells like because of the basil the olive oil and everything oh, it just mm, smells so good anyway i'm gonna go and eat that and then i'll probably work a little bit more on crochet i don't know what we're doing tonight so yeah it's gonna be I don't know what we're doing. I really don't know. Um, I put a little bit more makeup on today to um, test out the cloth a little bit more. Um, I did use it again last night, the pink cloth that is the um, makeup remover cloth. Um, <clears throat> I did use it last night and it just got rid of all of my makeup which was really really good. I haven't put as much foundation on today. I put on um, like a glow cream stuff, um, powder and then I put, um, I've got look, how bad is that? where I'm hot <laughs> um, but I have put eyeshadow on today You're probably not going to be able to tell but um, yeah I thought I would try a little bit more to see if they really do work with everything <laughs> uh, but when I do an a actual a full face where it's foundation powder contour blush everything that will be the test um, but I don't know when that will be because it might be tomorrow I might, depending on how hot it is, uh, because I don't really like wearing that much makeup when it's too hot. But anyway, I'm going to go and stop rambling and eat my lunch. So I've just got this out to um, do the extra squares that I need to do. And the only colours that I've got enough of <laughs> are the pink, the burgundy and the green. Um, I haven't got enough of the yellow. So I've got this left of the green and obviously another ball I've got this much left of the grey I don't have another ball and I have this teeny weeny little bit of yellow left um, obviously I haven't got another ball of this so I want your opinions on what colours to do um, I have got we all know you're going to use the pink <laughs> I might not use the pink. The pink's actually in the top anyway, so... Uh, but I have got um, this left of the white and a whole other ball of the white. Um, so, yeah, I really don't know what to do. Um, I'm not going to buy another ball. Um, it was from Lolly's, and I'm not going to just buy um, or order another ball just for the sake of it. It's not worth it, really. I'm not going to. 
I'm not. Um, so, yeah, give me your opinions. Um, I was going to do the squares in white, and most of you <laughs> said do, do them in colour, uh, but obviously I don't have enough colour, uh, so I'm a bit stuck. Um, yeah, I just don't know, so leave me your comments down below on what I should do. Um, if I had four different colours, then I would do the four squares in the four different colours with the white in between um, the rows, but yeah, I haven't got that. <laughs> uh, so yeah, I'm still a bit... Um, the only other ball I've got is this, but this doesn't go at all. It's the the dotty one, so that doesn't really go at all. That's the only other cotton that I've got. So yeah, I'm a bit stuck and we are deciding what to have for dinner. We don't know yet. Um, it's ten past seven and we're still undecided whether we're going out, whether we're staying in or we don't know. So I'll let you know when we know. It's now quarter to nine. Uh, we didn't go out for dinner, we just had dinner in. Um, Ian wasn't that hungry and yeah, we had food in so I cook. Um, I've put my wash my hair, I'll put it in plaits <laughs> because tomorrow I'm hoping that it will go curly or like wavy type thing, blurry, the light. Um, as because my roots are really really bad at the moment um, I'm just thinking that that might be a bit better just to sort of pin it up somehow. Um, so yeah I'm gonna end today here. Um, was there anything I was gonna say? No I mentioned my top before didn't I? us um yeah so i'm gonna end today here thank you for watching if you're not subscribed press that subscribe button the thumbs up leave me a comment down below and i shall see you all tomorrow bye